In our top story for you tonight, the East Baton Rouge Metro Council gave the green light for the 2023 city parish budget. Fox 44's Anam Siddiqui has been attending those budget hearings for quite some number of weeks now. Anam, joining us with the details, what did you find out? Well, Kellyanne, after weeks of hearing from different city departments, the Metro Council unanimously passed next year's budget. Mayor President Sharon Weston Broom says this budget focused a lot on public safety and stormwater issues. The East Baton Rouge Metro Council approved the city parish's $1.8 billion budget for 2023. That's about a 5% increase from this year. Our budget really reflects uh, some of the priorities that we consistently talk about in city parish government. Mayor President Sharon Weston Broom says those priorities include public safety. Nearly 56% of the city's general fund is dedicated to public safety. The budget gives the Baton Rouge Police Department thousands of dollars for hiring incentives and pay raises for first responders. We gave a 5% across the board raised to all of our city parish employees, but to our first responders, uh, our law enforcement, they received uh, an extra uh, 7% uh, raise. Stormwater problems is a big priority. Just hours before the budget meeting, the city parish was awarded a grant of an extra $5 million for tackling stormwater issues. This is the beginning. Councilwoman Lori Adams says council members were concerned the budget didn't have enough for the stormwater division, but she says she's pleased with the extra $5 million. Well, we're going to have to make a bigger annual commitment um, to taking care of our stormwater issues. I think this is a good start. I feel very uh, confident that the money that we have appropriated will help improve the overall quality of life for our citizens in Baton Rouge and East Baton Rouge Parish. And for anyone interested, the budget is available for the public. We have it posted at BRProud.com. Anam Siddiqui, Fox 44 News.